welcome to another session of our vlog. And uh, I have a question for you. Do you have the power of coagulation? Coagulation? Well, the uh, dictionary says that it's a noun and uh, it is defined as the action or process of a liquid, especially blood, changing to a solid or semi-solid state, a supplement that inhibits blood coagulation. It means that it stops the flood, the, the flow of the blood. So that is coagulation. I want you to imagine if our bodies do not allow our blood to coagulate, if your skin will be cut or pierced, blood will continue to flow. And we know that when blood continues to flow, we will suffer blood loss and eventually we die. So praise God that God has placed that power in our bodies so that we won't die because of blood loss. But some goes, same goes actually with gossip or unfettered animosity and fighting in, ha in the house or in the church or in the office or anywhere. If there is no restraint and there's a continue of buildup, we will suffer friendship loss, and eventually, fellowship would die. That is why the Bible says in Proverbs chapter 6, verses 16 to 19, there are six things that the Lord hates, seven that are an abomination to him, a haughty eye, a lying tongue, hands that shed innocent blood, a heart that devises wicked plans, feet that make haste to run to evil, a false witness who breathes out lies, and one who sows discord among brothers. If we do not become an agent of coagulation in uh, relationships, the Bible says in Proverbs 16, 28, a dishonest man spreads strife and a whisper separates close friends. So let us be that person that put a stop on gossip. Let us hit the brake on fighting so it will not escalate. Do not put fuel on the fire by siding on anyone. Let us be the peacemaker, the agent of being a peacemaker that God wants us to be. In Ephesians 4.29 says, Let no corrupting talk come out of your mouths, but only such as is good for building up, as fits the occasion that it may give grace to those who hear. Let the words that come out of our mouth are uh, be words that builds up people you know, in, in and out of season. Let there be grace you know, in every word that we say. And lastly, let us be the peacekeeper in Proverbs 21, 23 it says, whoever keeps his mouth and his tongue keeps himself out of trouble. So as a Christian, as a believer, let us always think this way. Let us put a stop on gossip. Let us coagulate fighting and animosity and be the peacemaker and peacekeeper that the Lord wants us to be. And with that, I would like to bless you uh, for your time in uh, giving me this time. God bless you uh, so much for today. I will see you again next vlog. So thank you so much for today. Bye-bye.